Of course, many outdoor activities are going to go on as scheduled for the next few days. Your kids might want to take part in them. They may not even notice it's as hot. Fox 4's Dave DeMarco live tonight in Kansas City, where kids in camps this evening are trying to beat the heat. Dave? Yeah, and it has been so hot, you might want to feel like you want to jump in a fountain. Now, I would not advise that. That would probably get you in trouble, right? But you know, this heat and humidity can also get you in trouble. That's why kids camps, plenty of outdoor activities already taking precautions. At Harris Park tonight, kids are hard at work on their cheers, chips, and crossovers. Whip. Yeah, I like that. But before giving kids any tips on the court or green, there's more important lessons to be learned in the cooling station. If you're really, really, really hot and you're sweating, what do you think you should do? Chris Harris purchased all the land on a full block at 41st and Wayne to create Harris Park, devoted to improving health in his community through sports. Free throw, free throw, free throw. It's for the game. Kobe. To, that's just a perfect way to acknowledge that, to, to show them the health. And so we're, it, it's becoming a norm. You know, when it's hot and it's water and we're teaching, uh, it teaches, it all falls in place. For parents who also had a chance to interact with Children's Mercy Hospital tonight, it's about still having fun with the kids, even in the heat of the summer. Try to get him more involved. I mean, so instead of staying home. So, I mean, I know the weather's hot, but you gotta stay active somehow. Drink cold water, keep hydrated. While making sure they are safe and feel comfortable calling a timeout if needed. All right, everybody got water, right? Grab some water. Back in the old days, I think there was a, almost like this toughness factor of not drinking water, and I think we've learned from that. So super important to keep kids hydrated and get a lot of water in them. With this program, I've noticed they bring a cooler out here, and they're constantly encouraging the kids to keep drinking water. Uh, the Kansas City Fire Department is actually advising leagues to go ahead and cancel or perhaps push back those games to later at night to try to make it safer for kids. You see some kids out here playing some soccer. Yeah, we're having some fun. So I'd say it's a little bit you could probably get away with it a little bit more now. Uh, Harris told me that for his part, he's going to go ahead and move stuff inside into the air condition tomorrow if he has to. Lauren. Dave, thank you. Dave DeMarco live on the plaza, Kansas City, Missouri.